The Flash is a student form for students produced by students. Students make all content decisions, research, write, shoot, and broadcast news stories they deem important to the ECU community. Stay tuned. Good spark, Eastview. Today is Thursday, June 3rd. And for seniors, it's our final day of high school ever. Wait, are you serious? Yeah. Oh my god, I didn't know that. I'm super excited. <laughs> First off, Lucas looks at some of the highlights of the Flash in the past two years. Secondly, Cleed takes a look at some seniors waiting for a special surprise. Lastly, Rain looks at some of the highlights from seniors at, here at ECU. Stay, Stay tuned, tuned for the Flash. Hey Cooper, do you remember our first time anchoring for the forecast? Oh my lord, I do remember that. It's almost like we planned it. That's all for today, ECU. Thanks for watching. Feels like just yesterday. Well, Lucas takes a trip down memory lane by showcasing some of the Flash's highlights for the past two years. Man, it has been a crazy year. Thank you to everyone who sat and watched through the Flash. Because of you guys, we were able to break the monotony of school and bring you stories every Friday. Now, because of your guys' commitment, even through COVID, we're going to give you guys a re-highlight of some of our greatest stories and some of our best achievements, and you might see some faces you haven't seen in a while. That's enough explaining for me. This is the class of 2021's Flash Highlights. In five, four, three, two. I think one of my favorite things that we did on the forecast that I worked on was um, the eye forecast where we all dressed up as iCarly characters and did that. It just made it super fun and it was super out of my comfort zone, but I had so much fun doing it and it's definitely something I'll just always remember. So we're going to be doing the next segment. So what we got planned is we're going to shave my head. So. I would say that my favorite event that I've been a part of in The Flash would have been the EV TV a thon last year. It was a thing where everyone kind of had a little block of time to do a live broadcast. So me and Thomas and some other people had our one hour chunk and we actually got to shave his head. And go back. Yeah, yes. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> and it was definitely a moment that I will never forget. Man, I can't believe it's been two years since we started. I'd say we come a long way. Yeah, speaking of that, do you remember the letters we wrote to ourselves freshman year? I do. Mine was very cringy. Well, as the year comes to a close, seniors are starting to get those letters. Sam and Khalid have the story. As seniors are gearing up to leave this year, some have a gift awaiting them. A gift that's four years in the making. Uh, we call it the graffiti wall, so it's kind of a... Uh, memory board of kind of their ninth grade year and kind of all the things that they've accomplished, uh, the goals that they set for themselves, uh, and just fun memories they had during the year. Um, Dave Nord, uh, who is one of uh, the original teachers of Team Tribolt, kind of started this tradition. Uh, and then once he retired, um, I kind of carried it on uh, within Team Tribolt. So he's kind of the originator of it, but it's been going on since uh, Eastview opened in 1997. It's almost like watching your kids open up Christmas presents just the excitement or just their face expressions, it almost always elicits an emotion. We caught up to some past tribolters to get their reactions. It's really weird to think that I wrote this four years ago in this exact like building. Because I have friends who put like old pictures, like someone put a packet of gum in theirs. Although it might be gross, it's really cool to look at and have that memory from four years ago. I, I predicted I would be going to college. Um, and playing football and I'm going to college at Dakota Wesleyan University next year and continuing to play football there. Looking back it shows how much I've changed as a person and how people change over time. Like all the rappers that I don't listen to anymore and all the Fortnite. And as they go off into the world, Mr. Wagner has some encouraging words. Um, I just wish them nothing but the best with anything that they choose to do in the future. Uh, and we'll be watching here to kind of see the great things that they do. Signing off for the flesh, this is Sam and Khalid. Hey Zian, what memorable moment of high school is your favorite? Sleeping, except I didn't do very much of that. Well, Rain looks at a few more exciting moments from other seniors' lives. Take it away. 
Although seniors spent their last year at Eastview without the full senior experience, they were still able to share their final memories with their classmates. I think my favorite memory was taking the medical healthcare class at Rosemount. Favorite high school memory probably freshman year, first time playing football. Oh, my favorite memory from high school has got to be uh, drumline lock-ins because they're all the percussion gets together, we play a bunch of games, uh, really good, good times with the, with the lock-ins for percussion. One of my favorite high school memories would probably be being involved in robotics and be able to build robots and design with the team. My favorite memory is probably the first time they announced that we'd get two weeks off of COVID, like for COVID because I had a chem test like the next day and I didn't want to take it. In the end, Eastview is a place that we can all look back to. To the school, we want to say, There's a lot of things that they could work on to make the school a better place, but other than that, it was a pretty okay experience. <laughs> Freshmen, sophomores, both of you just do your work, do good in school, then pretty much senior year like me, you won't have to do anything. Good luck, you chose a good school, and have fun. I'm ready to leave. Good luck to everyone with their future plans, and thank you Eastview for guiding us for these past four years. Signing off for the final time, this is Rain. And that's all we have for you today, Eastview. Thank you for watching The Flash this entire year. I hope you have a great summer. Stay tuned for the credits. And for the credits after those. to a theater farther away from you. Signing off for The Flash, this is Khalid Kumar. Hannah Olson. Rain Hartos. Lucas Novak. Sam Cardozo. Cooper McKenzie. CN. Got it. And Tommy Jacobs.